By the way, the guards tossed you in here. I can see you're no friend of theirs. I suppose I can trust you. In fact, maybe you can help me with a bit of a problem and make some money for yourself in the process. I'm in here for the long haul. They got me for murder, even though I didn't do it. Once the Count makes a ruling, there's no way it's changing. I owe all of this to that heartless, treacherous witch, Arnora. You want to know what happened? I'll tell you. I was betrayed, stabbed in the back. I'm in here and Arnora's out there, living in my house. Ah, we were doing petty crimes all over Cyrodiil. Small scores, 10 gold here, 25 there. Nothing big enough to have them investigate you. Then along comes Arnora with a plan to waylay a tax shipment headed for the Imperial City. We're talking serious gold, complete with armed escorts. I told her she was crazy, but she insisted. Women have a way of getting men to do what they want. So we did it. We ambushed the shipment. In the process, Arnora killed a guard. I told her to be careful and just knock them out, but she didn't listen. We then buried the gold in the woods. Then she disappears to get supplies. Suddenly, the campsite gets raided by the Bruma City Guard. There's no way they could have found us. Well, there's no doubt she tipped them off. But I was one step ahead. I had moved the loot while she was away. <laughs> My final revenge. Or was it? I'll tell you. I want Arnora dead. That's right, I said dead. She took my life away, and now I want hers taken as well. You do this for me, and you get the gold. All of it. All I need is proof is that damn amulet she always wears. Show that to me, and the money is yours. You want the gold? You bring me Arnora's amulet after she's dead. Finally, a chance for revenge.